My job is to support any mom with her feeding plan. Um, I mostly work with breastfeeding moms and how that works is any new mom and baby that come in and see the pediatrician normally on the second day of life and then onward, if they have any sort of breastfeeding question, pumping questions, if they're having trouble, if they're not sure if they're breastfeeding well, or if the pediatrician you know, sees something that looks a little bit off and might require lactation help, um, then they can refer to me and they make an appointment and come see me and we get it going from there. The first few days is a big learning curve. Um, just mom and baby getting to know each other. I usually say it's like learning to walk. We're all predisposed to do it, but it takes time and practice and good support, the right support to learn how to do it. Um, the baby's practicing latch, so they need to be at the breast often, and then they need to be well supported by nurses or lactation staff at the hospital so that mom can really practice getting a good hold on baby and a nice, comfortable, deep latch and learning signs of a good feed. There's not a lot of breast milk um, for each feed in the first few days, and that's so that baby can practice um, on those small volumes and gear up for those bigger, longer feeds. So lots of skin to skin time, lots of practice, um, uninterrupted bonding time with, with baby. So a good latch should mostly be comfortable. In the first few days, it might feel a little tender as that tissue gets used to being used, so almost like a chapped lip. But it's time to call for help when you have toe curling pain. Um, if baby's doing the search and find, they, they can't quite get a good grasp on that nipple. Um, they might be having a shallow latch, which you can think of as a kinked hose. Um, so there's not a lot of flow. Baby falls asleep all, all the time at the breast. You're constantly having to wake up baby, readjust, try and get a better latch. Um, we have lots of tricks and tips for that. Um, but you basically just want to try and get that um, nipple deep into the baby's mouth so that you don't have nipple damage, cracked bleeding nipples. That is not normal and that would be a great time to reach out to a lactation provider or your pediatrician for help. It can be really hard as your milk is transitioning from colostrum to that bigger volume. There can be a lot of swelling and almost like baby's trying to latch onto a beach ball. Baby's crying, everything changes and usually it's right when you get home from the hospital. <laughs> Things were going great in the hospital and you come home that first night, baby's you know, disoriented, they've kind of realized they've been born, they're a little out of sorts, um, latching feels different, and you, know, you, you really can take the time then to see if you need additional help. We try and see babies in, at um, you know, their, their second day home from the hospital, so usually by day five, and hopefully then the parent will express some of the concerns and frustrations to the pediatrician, and if they're breastfeeding related, um, they can just completely set up an appointment with me, um, sometimes the same day, and we really try and hit those issues fast to, to you know, make mom and baby more comfortable because yes, those nights are long and it can be really stressful when you don't know what you're doing and you need some help. Sometimes we'll have indicators, so um, mom will say the baby's falling asleep at the breast all the time. Um, usually the baby will lose a little too much weight if the latch is shallow and or mom has uh, milk supply issues or something. We'll see um, a slow weight gain or lack of weight gain or too much weight loss, which can then cue the pediatrician to reach out. Um, or if mom has certain feeding goals, um, if she struggled with supply with a previous pregnancy, um, sometimes we can get ahead of that and they can direct, direct the baby over to me. So if you are having trouble with breastfeeding, absolutely start by calling your pediatrician. Their nurse can uh, make an appointment with me as soon as they can get in, um, or you can call 225-246-9343 uh, and that's a direct line to the lactation department. Just leave a message, we'll get back to you as soon as we can and, and get you in for some help and sometimes we can even help you over the phone.